Hi everyone. So me and Amelia are learning hand massage today and I promised Amelia during lockdown that I'm going to teach her lots of massage techniques. Yeah. Which she's and, very excited about. Yeah, and today we're going to be doing hand massage. Hand. So we thought we'd start with hand massage because it's nice and easy to learn. So if you're watching either live or later, you need to grab somebody that you can practice on. So mummy or daddy. Hopefully mummies and daddies will be pleased because they'll get a nice relaxing hand massage. So what you need is a towel, just to make sure that you don't get oil on your clothes. Um, you need some kind of oil if you have it at home. We've got this one. We've got this oil here, which is a massage oil. If you don't have a massage oil, then have a look in your cupboard and see if you can find coconut oil, which quite often you cook with. Or you can use a moisturiser. The only problem with moisturiser is it soaks in very quickly, so you have to keep putting it back on again. So if you've got sleeves, make sure you roll them up. We don't want to get oil on any of your nice, pretty clothes. Okay, so let's start. Hopefully you can follow along if you're watching. So I'm going to show you on Amelia first, and then we'll have another practice and she can have a go on me. So... Take one of your mummy and daddy's hands and you're going to put your oil onto their hand or arm. So nice kind of sweepy movements as you come down. Does that feel nice? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to do a little bit on the arm first. So I'm going to circle my hands up. So little circles. So you've got your thumb on one side of the arm and your fingers on the other side of the arm. So circling up. Now some of your people who you're doing your massage on might like a nice light massage. Some might be happy with it being a little bit firmer. So ask your mum or dad whether it feels nice or whether you want them, whether they want you to go a little bit softer or a little bit harder. So then we can do the same thing on the inside. So it's easiest if you swap hands and we're gonna circle up again but on the inside of the arm. Does that feel a nice pressure, Amelia? Really? Yeah. yeah. So hands and arms is super relaxing. So this is really nice. You can do it on each other at the end of the day. So maybe you can massage mum yeah, or dad. And even, if, even if it's a hand massage, you can do your arm as well. Your arm as well, yeah. We like hand massages, don't we? Okay, so we've done a bit on the arm there. Now using your thumbs, we're gonna do little circles coming up the arm. Little circles with your thumb. Doesn't matter which way you go. Does that feel nice, Millie? Yeah. And then we're gonna come and we're gonna do little circles up the arm on the inside. So when you're practicing at home, you can put on some nice music to make it nice and relaxing. And then maybe mum or dad can give you a massage afterwards, help you sleep. Our oil smells absolutely lovely. So if you've got a nice oil, that helps. Then we're going to do something called follow the leader. So one hand comes up the arm and then the other hand comes up the arm. One hand comes up and then the other hand comes up. So like up. the game, follow the leader. Follow the leader, yeah, exactly. Yeah, like the actual game, follow like where one hand. person walks around and then the other. Yeah, person around person like in a circle. Play. Cool, good point, Millie. Okay, so now we're gonna come on to the hand. So we're gonna turn the hand upside down, so you've got the palm of the hand facing up. And then you're gonna use your thumbs and you're going to Bring them down the hand up towards the fingers. So one thumb, then the other thumb. One thumb, then the other thumb. This is nice and relaxing. Okay, how are we doing if you're following along? So we're gonna bring our fingers now onto the palm of the hand and we're gonna circle round. So circling into the hand. So then we're going to turn the hand around the other way and we're going to come on to the fingers. So hold the other hand in your hand and then with your thumb and your finger, so thumb and first finger, 
you're going to do little circles with your thumb coming up the finger and then you can give it a really gentle wiggle and a stretch away so circling all the way up a little wiggle and a stretch circling up the finger little wiggle and a stretch how does that feel Mealy? it's really um relaxing really relaxing <laughs> media already looks relaxed <laughs> so we're doing a little wiggle and a pull so guys if you're following along ask mummy and daddy or whoever you're doing whether it feels nice and they can give you some tips so we've done all the fingers now then we're going to turn the hand back round now this one's a bit tricky so you're going to put your little finger of this hand through oh, their thumb you like this one little finger from the other hand into their little finger so all you're doing is stretching their hand out so you can get to their hand nicely okay so you've got little finger and little finger go into their thumb little finger so you should just be able to see their three fingers in the middle still and the others are inside yours so once you're there you can then use your thumbs to come down the hand so you can push quite hard also you can go in circles you can go in circles yeah we do that one as well don't we that's nice when you've got the hands open so really anything you like this just means you've got their hand nice and stretched out and then the other one we sometimes do really isn't it we stretch away so you can start in the middle and stretch your thumbs away Yes, you can definitely go everywhere, you, anywhere, anywhere. you want. Anywhere. And you guys can actually change these things anyway. It's just giving you some ideas. And then you can change it to the bits you like. There might be some bits you like and some bits you don't like. So stretching away. There we go. And then we're going to turn back round. And we're going to do our arms again to finish we're going to come up follow the, the arm leader. follow the leader exactly me they up the arm sweeping round okay so let's do the other hand you want to do the other hand try it on me uh, yeah. yeah okay so give you some oil just be careful with your oil we've got enough or a bit more careful with your oil we don't want to get it everywhere just quickly rub it into your hands then that's it okay so you guys who are watching you can start on the next arm now that's it so you're going to spread your oil well done Mimi, all the way up the arm careful of mummy or daddy's top if they've got a top on you don't want to get oil on it that's it so now once you spread your oil we're going to do our circles do you remember the circles so you're going to come up the arm like this oh, yeah. That's it, so circling up the outside, lovely. And Amelia's got a nice little pressure on her thumb here, so as she's coming up, she's pushing with her fingers and she's also pushing with her thumb, which is really nice. So coming up this way, up the arm, lovely, good one. And then coming back down. And then we're gonna do the inside, so you're gonna swap hands, or you can use this hand. And we're going to circle, that's it. So circle your fingers up, guys, and your thumb. Lovely, well done, Millie. That's really nice. So remember, ask mummy or daddy, whoever you're doing your massage on, whether it's a nice pressure. If they've had a massage before, they'll be used to being asked that because sometimes people do their massage light, sometimes they do it firm. And Millie's got a lovely firm pressure there. Well done, she knows mummy likes a firm massage. Fantastic. Yeah, not too hard. Not too, not too hard. Not too yeah, hard. guys, not too hard. That would not be nice. But yeah, yeah, don't go too hard. Somewhere in between, eh? Yeah. So then we're going to come on to our thumb circles. So up here. So you're going to use your thumb and you're going to work in circles all the way up. That's it. You can follow a nice straight line and come all the way up to the elbow. So when you're doing this, guys, imagine that you're your mum or dad has got three lines on their arm so media's just gone up the middle line and then come down and work on the outside line really so always slide yourself down when you've done your circles so come down in a straight line and then you're going to do another line on the outside so keep using those thumbs 
So you want to divide your arm into three lines, that's it, and then sweep down. So that's it, not too fast, and then come onto the outside and do the same. So we're going up our third line now, using circles with the thumbs. How are we all getting on if you're watching? Or, oh, like Amelia's doing, she's doing two thumbs at a time. That's actually a really good alternative. That's lovely. Oh, yeah. And then slide down, that's it. Now then turn mum or dad's arm up the other way so you can start working on the inside and we'll do circles again. Here we go, look, Amelia's showing you the two-handed version. That feels lovely, actually. So either come up with one hand and then slide down or you can come up with two hands. So you can play around, that's it. And the most important thing when you're learning massage is to make sure that you always keep in contact. So rather than when you get to the top, take your hand off, you can always slide back down, it feels nicer. And then one more line, that's it, working, that's it, with your thumbs, lovely. Does anyone know what comes up next? Next it is, do you remember? Um, Follow the leader. Oh uh, yeah. So you're going to turn mum or dad's arm back round, so you've got the top of their arm, and then you're going to sweep up and round following the leader. So this, so this one comes up and round, and then now the next hand comes up and round the other way. This is quite a hard one to master, so you might oh, all, I get it now. That's it, you might all need to practice this, or mum or dad can help. Perfect. Lovely. Like you, you like a line down the middle. Yeah, so you come up the middle and out one side, up the middle. That is perfect, Amelia. Well done. That's it, guys. So you're doing following the leader, round and round. That feels so nice and relaxing. And you can practice this as many times as you want at home. You can keep watching until you're able to do it on your own. Also, it's really hard not to get confused by going the same what, way the instead of uh, going the opposite. Yeah, that would be okay too, though, I guess. You could do it the same way. Lovely. And this oil smells so lovely. I feel relaxed already. It smells a bit like lavender or something. I think it has got some lavender. Oh, Lucy's saying, can we hire her? This is the plan, Lucy. Mm -hmm. Mimi's going to work for us one day. By the end of lockdown, she'll be a pro. This is brilliant. Right, guys. Then we're going to come on to the hand. So we're going to turn the hand over and we're going to work with our thumbs. That's it. So you can either do circles with your thumbs like Amelia's doing, that's lovely. You can see she's done some hand massage before. Or can you show them the one way you drag your thumbs down, coming down this way? Yeah. So one hand, so do one then the other, so you're doing follow the leader, that's it. So follow the leader, thumbs down. Lovely, and can you see Amelia's got my hand supported on her lap? That's a good idea, because it means then mum or dad or whoever's having the massage, their arm can be nice and relaxed whilst you're doing it. That's so nice. Then we're going to do with our whole fingers, guys. So you get all of your fingers and then you can circle into the palm. And that's it. Circling around. So maybe you, what's your easiest hand? Uh, this oh, one. Okay, so hold with that hand and then use your fingers to circle. There we go, that's it. So doing nice big circles around the, the palm of the hand. That feels really good. Okay, so then we're going to do fingers. This is the fun one. So turn the hand, uh, uh, yeah, turn the hand over. And then, yeah, so you've got your thumb and your finger and you're working, circling around each finger one at a time and then come back to the top with, oh, look at that. You did a great wiggle and pull. So circling, that's it. So you want to leave each finger out, that's it. Give a little wiggle, guys, and then pull off the end and stretch, lovely. So when you're doing this, just make sure you do one finger at a time and move the other fingers out the way. There we go, so circling. And you have to remember not to forget the thumb when you do this as well, because sometimes it's hiding out the way. So circling, wiggle, and pull. Media's got the perfect pull there. You kind of give it a, a little tug as you pull away. That's lovely. Right, then we're going to do the tricky one. So turning the hand upside down and your little fingers, guys. You need to get your little finger, that's it, and your other little finger, and then that's it, you're right. 
and then stretch them, stretch the hand out. So can you see I've got three fingers showing and this is perfect for you. So you've got hold of mum or dad's little finger and mum or dad's yes, thumb so you with you your separate fingers. separate these, all those ones and you put your hook with pink, your own your pinky. pinky in the other one and then you hook your pinky with that's it so now their hands open then you can use your thumbs or your fingers really yeah you can use your thumbs to work into the hand this feels really nice for mum or dad because their hands all stretched out really nice that is so good so working with your thumbs you can just play around you can do circles you can do lines just nice massage that's lovely into the hand there and just think mums and dads if your children can give you a hand massage, how nice the end of the day will be after you've helped them all day with their schoolwork. This could be my treat mini. <laughs> I help you with school. We've done maths today, we've done angles today, and yeah. then in a minute, Amelia will know this routine and she can just give me a hand massage and I can put music on relax. What do mums yeah. think about that? That sounds cool. Okay, so to finish off, we're gonna turn the hand around the other way. And we're going to do our follow the leader on the arms. Can you remember that, guys? So you're coming up and round and down. Perfect. Scooping the next arm up and round. That's it. Up and round. And up and round. Lovely. Two more. And then you can finish just by holding their hand, either with two hands. That's it. Lovely. Thank you so much. That was delicious. So we hope you liked our massage. I think hand is probably the easiest, so practice on your hand. Let us know in the comments how you found it, and then we'll come back another day and do some other areas. What do you think we should do next? Shoulder. Shoulder. Anything else? Or head. Head. That would be nice. A head massage for mum or dad. Mm. That would be good. And then mum or dad, Those I think you... People, um, and also, like... For head massage, it's easier kind of to be more laying down yes. a bit. So we so, can do that one. Yeah, so, so then for like grown ups, then they can lay down a bit because the the kids can't really reach. They might not be able to reach that no. well. So maybe when we do the head, we'll get you all on the sofa. We'll mm. lie back, and you can have your head in the hands. So we're going to come back another day and do those. Mm -hmm. And hopefully, you guys have enjoyed our massage training. Amelia is going to keep practicing with her hands and then we'll be back soon. Yeah. Cool. Bye.